everybody, we're still on our site run and we've come to Grace City Phase 1. You definitely know this property by now because you've seen several videos on it. We started this project for one of our clients recently and we're back to give you an update. In the previous video, I spoke with Engineer Desmond and he explained, you know, the footing works and the block works that's happening. And today I'm back with Estate Manager Lovington to just tell us the progress they've made made i see a lot of block works because when i came previously uh I, I think the block work it wasn't this high but i see some improvements and the demarcations are more clearer now so yes tell us a little bit about what's going on okay thank you very much adwa for having me on your channel <laughs> as usual my name is sakode ufuri mm -hmm. lavington mm -hmm. like you said and the last time we came here we are, we are at the footing stage yeah and as you can see we've made major progress yeah so that tells you that we accelerate our works on site okay. and we move at a very faster pace. I can see yes, that. There, there's a lot of planning that goes into this on the board before we come here mm -hmm. to execute it on grounds. Right. So as you can see, the footing stage is 100% done. It's completed it's complete. now. Okay. So we move forward to work on the ground beams. So as we speak, the steel benders are fabricating the mm -hmm. stirrups for the beams. Okay. Yes. I'll show you a stirrups. I'm, I know you are wondering what the stirrups is. <laughs> so I'll show you one. Okay. So we are working on the stirrups. All right. So when it's done, then we come and fabricate the ground beams. Mm -hmm. And with this particular building, you can see it's a very huge edifice. It's huge. Yeah. I hear it's it's almost two plots, right? Yes, it's two plots. Wow. And the square area is about 460 square meters okay. for the floor area. And with this, the ground beam has a depth of 300 mm. Okay. Yes, that's very deep. Before the slab comes, that's the oversized concrete right. of 150 mm. Okay. Yes. So when we are done with the ground beams, the next step is to start with the hardcore filling. Okay. Yes. So we we'll import. And that will start very soon. It will right? start very soon. Okay. So probably the next time you come, I'm mm -hmm. sure we would have made progress with that one. Okay. Yes. So when we work on the hardcore filling, what we'll do is we compact in layers. Mm -hmm. Yes. And we water it down take our time for it to compact set, it properly yes and compact it in layers uh -huh. before we move on to work on our oversized concrete too i see i forgot to mention with the ground beams as well uh -huh. when we are done fabricating we make sure we cast the concrete okay. the 300 mm uh -huh. i mentioned earlier yeah. on yes before we proceed to the compaction wow. and then finally we cast the oversized concrete yes that's so, interesting as you can see the ground floor has two bedrooms okay that's one master bedroom and mm -hmm. one standard size bedroom okay and the first floor also has three bedrooms so five bedrooms in total so you can see it's this a very a huge, huge building yes. <laughs> it's a huge property yes. i find that very interesting i see the columns in there yeah. and uh, i heard the mortar is going to go in concrete concrete yes, is please. going to go inside yes, and then after the boards will go off yes. and then we'll see, you know, the pillars very well. Yeah. Wow. So as you can see, our carpenters are working yes. hard to make sure they can box our short columns mm -hmm. or foundation columns for us. Mm -hmm. Then we cast as soon as possible. Okay. We'll be done very soon. Then we proceed to the fabrication of the ground beams. Yeah. We bore that one as well. Then we proceed to the next step. So we are there. working around the clock very fast yeah. we make sure we always work ahead schedule mm -hmm. so that at least we can always be ahead of the project and deliver for our clients yes because yes. i know the clients are always asking oh what's the update on of the course project? they always want where have we gotten to yes, like yes, how yes. is my building looking yes. now so it's yes. necessary that we are always able to come here exactly. get the content and then put it out for your eyes to see that things are indeed happening and i love the fact that you liaise very closely with the workers on site exactly because i important. see uh engineer george here all the time engineer yeah. desmond yeah. yourself you're always here yeah. checking is this right because we have to always and always give the client a hundred percent right yes, exactly. and make sure that we're giving them what they want their exactly. dream properties yeah. so i love that fact about rke yeah. that's interesting so when next do you want me to come back to take an update when do you want to come <laughs> 
If you leave, I'll be here every day. <laughs> you can come. We'll take you through every stage. I see. So we are always ready for you. Okay. That's amazing. Well, guys, you can see it for yourself. So much is happening. We'll definitely come back when they are on to the next stages of this project. So do subscribe to the channel, like the video, share it. We'll be back with more updates. Peace out.